What began as a peaceful process to elect new leaders for the National Youth Organizer and Women's Wing of the National Democratic Congress degenerated into pockets of violence as a result of clashes between factions within the party on December 10 last year. After police intervention, calm was restored, but not without some drama. Sixteen persons were declared wanted by the police with a bounty of 10,000 Ghana cities to anyone who would provide information leading to the arrest. Almost four weeks being declared wanted, the police arrested three of them at their hideouts in Tamale, in the northern region. Appearing in court on Wednesday, Abdul Halid Shaibu, also known as Olu, and Razak Ibrahim, alias Oga, pleaded not guilty to charges of prohibition of vigilante groups and activities. Lead prosecutor, Superintendent Sylvester Asari, objected to a bill application filed by counsels for the accused persons, Lamti Abanga, Paul Asibi Abariga, and Ali Jafaru. The court, presided over by Samuel Bright Aqua, noted that if granted bail, the suspects will have sconed since they are not residents of the jurisdiction. Counsel for the accused persons had argued that the duo are security personnel at a pub in Tamale and hence would show up in court if granted bail. The court added that the duo would interfere with investigations since the police is also on a manhunt for 14 others. Citing the gravity of the offence, which has a minimum of 10 years imprisonment, presiding judge Samuel Bright Aqua stressed the need to make vigilantism unattractive. He denied the bill application and reminded custody. The accused person, Dauda Mohammed Nazir, pleaded guilty to the charge of prohibition of vigilante groups and activities and was convicted on his own plea. Lord Edward, sorry. TV3 News, Accra.